Hello, my name is Jimmy Hua. I'm married with Nadine. We are having two children, Benny and uh, Myros. And uh, we are Waiwamas. We are also refugees in Zaleka refugee camp, serving the Lord in the area of farming and also support ministry. In the area of sports, we are having an academy called Heroes Waiwam Academy, where we have uh, five teams under 21 for boys and uh, under 17, under 15 and uh, under 12. And also we are starting uh, under 10. Plus that we have one team of uh, girls team. There is excitement. There is a lot of we can tell you that the Lord has done it to us. As we focus for two things, physical and also spiritual and also emotional. Right now, there are some boys, like a free boys, who are going to play in a national team's level. Not just national, but in a team that are TNM Super League in Malawi, which is amazing. And also their behavior. Parents are telling us testimony how their children are behaving in their homes. So we are rejoicing when to see the child who is behaving well, who don't like to stay at home, but today, he or she is staying at home, helping the parents understand what is happening. So those are the joyful. The reason we are doing this, when we hear the testimony, we hear the testimony from the family or from the community, it gives us a, a courage that we do it as a discipleship sports ministry. Please keep praying with us. The two children right now, they, they are going, and the others, they are telling us that, Coach, we need to stay with you. There has been a lot of things that we can tell you, but when you come and you want to start a sport ministry, this is a moment. Don't just stop. Start where you are. Start in the street. Start in the, in the ground. Start in the, in, in the road. Children, they need people whom they can hear from. They need you to start something. When you start, they will come to you and you will start telling them about the love of God. And the sports, a soccer is one of the key that you can use so that you can reach many young people in the kingdom of God. God bless you.